It'll be tough to rush down a lot of Tucson roads this summer. The city of Tucson has a long list of streets in line for road work in the next weeks and months, all in the name of smooth, safe rides when the work is done. K-Gun not in your sides. Craig Smith has more in this road roundup. You are probably going to see a lot more of your little orange and white friends this summer, and you're going to see a lot more of the bumper of the car in front of you. That's because the city of Tucson is using the upcoming summer to get a lot of road work done. Work's already been underway on this part of Old Spanish Trail near 22nd Street. It's an example of road repairs made possible when Tucson voters approved bonds so the city could borrow the money it takes. Some of the work is reaching smaller neighborhood streets, like the streets just north of Peter Howell Elementary School near Columbus and Fifth. Yeah, Engineer Sam Crato says there's less traffic in the summer, but what's really driving the surge in projects now is the urge to get the job done. We have uh, a little bit of everything right now. Um, in fact, we have some really large streets like Irvington Road that are going to be receiving some new pavement. We also have six neighborhoods that are receiving new paving as well. So it's really a mixture of both that we're currently working on. 14 new city projects are starting soon. Projects set for next week include the Grant and Craycroft area, including Grant to the north, Pima to the south, Suara to the east, and Craycroft to the west. The Fairgrounds area, including Ajo to the north, Irvington to the south, Park to the east, and 6th Avenue to the west. In mid-June, work will start on Irvington Road from I-19 to 6th Avenue, Tucson Boulevard from Fort Lowell to Grant, Rosemont from Speedway to Winsett. Some current road projects will be wrapping up soon. The Pima and Wilmot intersection should be done next week, and long-term work on Houghton near 22nd should finish in August. Craig Smith, KGUN 9, on your side.